All right. With Ohio's economy having a surplus for the first time in a generation, how would you continue economic momentum? Well, that's a, a good question. And I would like to answer it tomorrow. And also, I'm out of water. I have water for you. Oh. We're, we're going to lose this election. No, no, no. We ain't going to lose this election. Mm -hmm. uh, come here. You know what I told you I'd do before I lose an election? No. Oh. Yes, that was crazy. Should I do it? Yeah. You should do it. Yeah. yeah. Although I think my opponent would make a great grandfather of the year, I think I'd make a better governor. That's what I'm saying. So Cleveland, Youngstown, Columbus, and all the southern districts are in. Well, we're waiting on that, but I don't think it matters. We got this. It's ours. Congratulations, Mr. Governor. We won. We won. Yeah! If you don't mind, I'd like to say uh, a few things. There are three things that I'm grateful for at this moment. The first is the way we ran this campaign. I'm proud of everyone in this room. The second thing, I recently met someone, and I, I am just giddy. It's in that early phase where just everything is exciting. Anything, holding hands, seeing each other, just walking into the same room. Third thing is that I'm proud and grateful for this man right here. I'm gonna cry now. It's gonna be a weird cry. This all started with a bet in a restaurant. Is that right? A bet that we could get anyone elected to anything. And we did. This was never about the state of Ohio or Ben Condon. It's about what we did. We changed the way that election narratives are hijacked. Y'all are political professionals. You should be proud of that. I'm proud of you. You love your work. And you learned a lot. We all learned a lot. Like the difference between shooting someone in the ass and shooting them in their femur. Ain't that right, Mary Beth? <laughs> <laughs> you should have seen her out there. She went, uh, It was like Wiley e. Coyote down there. Hey, you dumb knucklehead. Hey, well, give yourself. Come on. Thank you. I just heard from Governor Lester, who offers his congratulations. I cannot believe I am governor. <laughs> oh, I should say now, we have a, a family cruise planned in October for my aunt's 80th birthday, so I will be gone for three weeks for the cruise. I hope that's okay. 
Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your vote.